Alright, what's up YouTube? You're here with Elijah from Juggernaut Reptiles. I'm going to do an update video on uh, a couple of snakes, about five snakes that have grown quite quite a bit. I'm going to do it in uh, sections. I have to go to different rooms to get them out. So right here we got um, Nemesis, my female green anaconda. She doesn't really like being handled all too much. Growing nice and slow. She's uh, a weird feeder. She won't feed in um in in the ball file cages. She only tends to eat while she's in a rack system. So Let's see if we can get her. Come closer on her face. Yeah, she really doesn't really care to be handled all that much. See how she's gotten pretty big already. Mm -hmm. You see that awesome belly they got. Her green is pretty, pretty interesting. Let's see, there we go. All right, so I'm gonna get the next snake out. Alright, here goes the second snake. This is my female Sumatran short tail python or black blood python as most would call them, but they're actually not part of the python um blood python. They're not the same as blood pythons. Let's see. There we go. She's got pretty big, really nice and dark. So I get a tail out. You'll be alright. I got her right here in a CB70 tub. So you can see her size. She's a nice black head. She's just she's a darker, really nice dark one. Not the darkest. And there's some out there that are completely lacking any of this brown or silver. Almost almost completely solid black, jet black. But she is definitely a dark one. Let's see. I'm going to show you a pickup I got, I think about three months ago, of another Sumatran, which is actually a chrome head instead of a black head like this one, like this girl. So this, this guy's um, a silver phase color. Let's see if I can get him out for use. Put him right now. Put him in. Oh my god. Alright, so there goes a really nice chrome male that I'll be putting with her eventually. This guy's just gonna get nicer with the silver. And this girl's still gonna get darker. Black. See if we can get them in there for you. Get them there, huh? Boom. There they go. It looks real nice right now. That's what we call a chrome head, Sumatra short tail. And a black head. Alright, so get this camera over real quick so that I can take this female out for use. Give you an idea how big she actually is. See how chunky she is. Good snake. Never strikes anything, just hisses like most short tails. Nice white belly, I believe. 
And that's it. So here goes the third snake. See if any of you can guess what it is before I mention it. All right, this is my female Super Bowl, also known as um, it's a hybrid of a ball python times blood python. I see how big she is in this tub. Let's see, definitely got that ball python head going. Just on a bigger scale. And then the size of a blood python. Let's see. If I could get it a wrap, maybe a little bit. There we go. Haven't shown this girl in a while. So this is what you get when you cross a ball python with a blood python. I'm going to take out for you just to show you how big she really is. I believe she's about maybe 17 pounds so and she will get bigger than this too they get very close to the same size as a blood python see the wicker pattern when I showed this girl the first time she was real tiny I think second video I ever posted on YouTube so she's been with me for quite a while since I first started my YouTube channel she's coming up good camera there we go and that's it All right, so here goes the fourth snake, my female Argentine boa. See if we can get you that head. Come on. She like she's very much like a retic. They like to go up. That's why you're holding them. But she's gotten real big. She's trying to get that real big head. Let's see. picking up. Yeah, she is moving a lot. Definitely similar to retics in the way they move a lot. She's holding a nice dark color pretty well. I'm not even sure how big she is. She's probably Five feet, six feet. She's getting real big, quick. This animal never misses a meal. Alright, here goes the fifth and final snake. Xena, my female yellow anaconda. She's been feeding, started feeding on guinea pigs already. And during the summer, she really starts to feed up real well. The winter, she's uh, on and off feeder. So she should be packing on some size before the new year. But she has my one arm just done. See if I can get her around. 
Yeah, come on. Yeah, these guys always problems. I'm telling you. Pumps the power is nothing like an anaconda's power. She's got a belly. She's real big. She's really packing with some size now. She's trying to get away. That's that thing. You got a head? Mm-hmm. See how nice she's looking? Mm-hmm. Hopefully I can get this girl as big as my male green Spartan. She is definitely dying big. Let's see. Kind of hard to stretch out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, you can see the color of my arms. She's turning them purple. Oh, I can't. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, because it won't focus. <laughs> That's it. Later.